Are you dialed in for 2024? What's going on? How are you doing? I'm Bill DeWeese, professional voiceover talent, voiceover coach, voiceover demo producer. I hope you had a wonderful holiday. I know typically we get together every weekday, but uh, it was really nice taking some uh, some time off and spending time with the family. I hope that you had some great visits. You know, I have a, a two-day rule. As long as, as long as you keep visits away from home, shorter than two days with any particular person or set of people, things run pretty well. I've heard people going for three-day rule, but sometimes you need kind of those things just to help things go smoothly. So whatever you had to do to manage your situation, I hope you did it. I hope you did it well and that things went very well for you. Thanks for being here this morning. Kicking off a brand new year and congratulations to Ron in Charleston, South Carolina. Ron, first on this morning. Yes, happy new year to you. Number one for the year. Well, there's something you can put on your resume. Really excited to get started again. It's, um, you know, one of the, uh, I guess the, one of the down things um, uh, of the holidays, the, not so exciting, was COVID hit our family. And it hit my, my granddaughter uh, right after Christmas. And I think this is her second bout with it. And then my wife, Vicky, got it right after that. This is her second bout with it. Well, I'm, you know, what they call super dodger, you know, haven't had it and feeling pretty good about myself. And last night, I'm pretty sure it hit me because I had a rough night last night, not feeling so well today. So you, I don't know if you'll be seeing me for the rest of the week, but I want to make sure at least I got in here once uh, to get the, uh, the new year started off. Right. So we'll, we'll, we'll see what's going on. You know, I'm not, I'm functional right now. I'm functional and let's hope it stays that way. We'll see. So I want to talk to you about getting started on the right foot, getting dialed in for the year. And I want to use the metaphor. I know you've all heard this before, but it's such a good, it's a good metaphor. And it's the, it's the jet airplane that flies from LAX in Los Angeles to Boston. And so the pilot dials in the settings, decides not to use, you know, autopilot. So this is manually, but dials everything, you know, he's pointed in exactly the right direction, sets it, forgets it. Well, several hours later, uh, he's notified that he's approaching the airport. But um, as he checks further, he realizes that he's not approaching Boston like he thought. And when he left, he's approaching Miami. Well, how did that happen? Well, I think you know the answer to that. If you're when you're going on a trip like that, it doesn't take a lot. As a matter of fact, it can be a matter of degrees that's not even perceptible in the moment that you're off course. And for a while, it may look OK. But what happens if you don't do a course correction, you eventually will drift further and further and further and further until you're off the map from your target. So my question for you this morning is, when was the last time you did a voiceover diagnostic? When did you check to see where you're at to make sure that everything is firing on all cylinders? Do you even know what to check for? Um, that's what I wanted to talk about this week. And again, I'm not sure whether I'll be able to be here tomorrow. We'll see. Hopefully I won't get any worse than I am now and I'll be able to keep doing this. And so I didn't want to cram everything in one morning, but there's, there's four things that I think are absolutely critical to look at. And uh, what I'm going to talk about just very briefly this morning is number one, you've heard me talk about it a hundred times. I'm going to keep on talking about it because we know this is, this is a data-driven thing. We know this from research with voice seekers that audio quality is the number one thing they're looking for. It's not your price. It's not even the sound of your voice. It's the quality of your audio. And so if you have not, if you're not 100% sure that your audio sounds great, when I say great audio, I'm not talking about how expensive your microphone is. That has very little to do with it. I'm talking about your space. Is it well treated? Or have you eliminated that big boxy echo sound, all that extra reverb? Are you dialed in correctly with equalization and compression? Um, and if these things are foreign to you, you check out, you need to go to my resources below in the, uh, below in the description, a part of my voiceover, you know, program, the voiceover blueprint is helping people to make sure that they are dialed into these things that I, that I talk about, but you may need to have somebody who's an expert, take a listen and give you feedback. But before you do anything, before you waste your time doing auditions, before you waste your time recording, make sure that your audio sounds great. And the great thing is Today, you don't have to own a whisper room. You don't have to build a studio from, from scratch. There, um, 
there are things that you can do. There are materials that you can buy, sound dampening, and there are some great software plugins to pick up the slack when it comes to noise reduction and even like a reverb reduction. It's amazing the stuff that's out there. So there are tools to help pretty much anybody in pretty much any situation. But don't make that mistake of you know, getting all excited about 2024. You're, you, know, you feel like you're in the right direction and you go and you haven't really checked to see if you're dialed in exactly in the direction you want to go. And by the way, when I say dialed in, this is not a once a year thing. You need to be doing this at least once every quarter, at least, because again, things drift. That's, you know, it's a, it's a part of being human. Things drift, we drift, and we need to, to recalibrate and be brought back on point because you don't want to think you're headed to Boston and end up in Miami. Although this time of year, Miami might not be such a bad place to go. So I get it. But other than that, probably not where you're looking to head. So make sure you've got your audio dialed in. And again, hopefully if uh, COVID um, allows me, I'll be back tomorrow to talk about the, the second thing. Let's check in and see who we've got. I'm not sure I'm going to make it to everybody on here, but let's just see. I want to do some shout outs. Ron, we got Corey and Scott, Rebecca, Aaron, uh, Rusty, AG. How are you doing? Riley, Nephi, Greg, David, uh, Amisha, Brian, Dale, Ethan, Don, GS, Susan, Sandra, MG, Robert, Darby, Anna Marie, Mike, Nathan, uh, DJ, Sandra, Jess, Don, HA, Beach Life, Wade, Terry, John, Brian, Theo. You know, okay, I've got to read Theo's because he, Theo is such a wordsmith. Uh, Happy New Year from chilly downtown Chicago. Lots of people out on the sidewalks this morning. This place is a buzzing. I guess people excited to start the new year. Uh, Anthony, Megan, Mark, Denise, uh, let's see here, Michelle, Wally, Voice 156 in Holland. Thank you for being here today. Bill, Wayne, Cara, Doug, uh, Professor Tracy, guys. Hey, thanks again for being here. I, I do appreciate it. Forgive all of this. And uh, be in the process of start your diagnostics today. Today, spend some time listening to your audio. Is it the best it can be? And maybe it is. And if it is, I'm not suggesting you start messing around with something that's dialed in. But there are so many. If we were to look at the entire population of voiceover talent, my guess is a good 75 to 80% would not be dialed in properly. Which means there are a lot of people who are just struggling and they don't, they don't know why. And it's because they're audio. It's because they're audio. Don't let that be you. Check it out. Get some help. Get it dialed in. Oh, by the way, by the way, ah, I almost forgot. For a limited time, uh, I have a training for you. It's my New Year Accelerator. It's, it's my favorite, I think, the most strategic uh, and effective tips, tricks, strategies for your business, for your voiceover business in this new year. It's only available for a limited time. There's a link in the description. And also I've got a bonus training um, on how to turn your communication in your collections activities with clients into a marketing activity, making sure you get that money and also uh, increase the goodwill with your clients so that they hire you more and more and more. So check out the link below. You can see the description of that. Um, again, want to make sure that you're started on the right foot for 2024. Thanks for being here. Have a great day. We'll talk to you guys soon.